Um, my season ended with a 40 and 4 record as a sophomore, and I won five tournaments. Olathe Northwest Wrestling had a constructive season with two wrestlers placing in state. Um, I was pretty proud of taking fourth at state as a sophomore, but I wish I could have done a little bit better, but it was still pretty cool with only one other on W Kid placing. And the team struggled, however, with a loss of star wrestler Kavion due to an injury, but took the struggle and turned this into a huge turnaround. Um, well, I, had, I probably had a lot more, probably around 10 times more emotional pain through the season than physical pain. Just having to sit out on the sidelines and seeing guys that you know you can beat and you beat last year that are going out there and winning and you're like, I can, I can do that too, but I, I just have to sit and watch. So um, finally winning that last match and um, taking out a guy that a lot of people had said was going to uh, kind of destroy me at regionals, um, in the regional finals. But uh, taking him out and uh, ending my season like that really kind of solidified the fact that um, I'm a competitor. I like, to, I like to compete and that no one can stop you, you know. With 10 senior wrestlers mentoring and teaching the younger competitors so that they can grow into more dominant wrestlers in the future. I think we've got a, we, we've got kind of a halfway young, halfway old team. We're, we're graduating 10, um, 10 seniors this year. Going to be, there's going to be a little bit of a hole left when we leave, but we've got young guys that um, are on the come up and they're ready to step up. Step up. Olathe Northwest wrestlers are happy with the result of this season and look to build and expand into future seasons and to continue to dominate on the mat. Good luck with everything, boys.